how to sell Canva templates using Payhip. Hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how you can sell your Canva templates created on this website. This is a magnificent uh, design website uh, that you can go ahead and create and customize the templates on a Payhip. And as you can see here, we have the products and we have the setup, uh, the checkout and everything. Now, all you have to do is to follow up the tutorial and you are going to make sure everything will go well for the win that tutorial and you will be good to go. Now, first go to payhip.com, then you have only to sign in to your account. After you have signed into your account, you are going to be faced with this, the, this page and you are going to click on products. Here you have to add the product that you want. Click on add a new product. Then we have the type of products. We have digital products, course, membership, physical product, bundle, or coaching service. I'm going to click on a digital product. Here we have the title. I'm going to put, for example, um, Canva templates, for example, templates for social, social media like that and here we have going to put the price I'm going to put for example $15 you can go ahead and select the uh, currency from the parameters or the settings here we have the cover here we have the uh, product file I am going to let it at the last part and here we have the product uh, image or the product cover I'm going to select any cover that I have for example, I'm going to put this one as a cover. It will be uploaded. And then we have here a description. I'm going to put a little description. Let's say here is three Canva templates that you can fully, for example, fully customize. Customize like that customize and buy yourself your self to uh, upload them or post them to post them on social media social media like Instagram or Pinterest here we have it I'm going to put a point here and here we have the visibility you can put uh, you have to put or you cannot uh, you have to put the uh, product visible and then we are going to proceed to the upload file product on Canva if you want to sell a design all you have to do is to give the access to that design and in order to make the access for that design, I'm going simply to select a design that I have on Canva. Then I will let you see how we can do that. Here we have the logos. I'm going to use this template. Here are we have the uh, three, as you can see, the templates that we are going to use for social media. These are some Instagram post uh, dimensions. And to make the customer uh, go ahead and customize these product or these uh, templates, it is very simple. You are going to create the, uh, the templates. Then we are going to click on share. Under the share, we have the collaboration link. You are going to give the permission to the viewer to edit those uh, templates. So you click only on this drop down menu. Here we have to click on anyone with the link. And here we have the option, they can view only, comment or edit. I will let it as can edit. Click on copy link. And then we are going to Canva again. Let's go to Canva. Then we are going to create a thank you page or a thank you PDF file. I will let you see that I have created already a, a PDF looking like uh, this is it. This is the thank you page. Here we have, I have set up a page especially for the PDF format. We have here the Canva logo, Canva templates for editing to make posts on Instagram, three templates with three different colors or elements, 
and simply here you are going to put the collaboration link that we've got from the design we'll go back to the design that i have let's search for it edit this template i will go ahead and get the link again simply click on share here i'm going to click on this one can edit copy link go back right here and then you are going to put a little description click here are three templates with three different colors and elements click here to modify them i'm going to select the here then i'm going simply simply to click on link it will appear automatically i'm going to uh, paste that link click on done also click on done and here we have it then we are going to download this page this thank you page as a pdf i'm going to select the file type as a pdf then I'm simply going to download. This is the PDF format. And simply we are going back to the pay hip. Click upload a product file. And we will search or and seek for the PDF that we have. It will be uploaded in a few seconds. Then we are going simply to wait for it. Here we have it. Everything is uploaded. Now go to add product and here we have it here we have the link of the product when you go ahead and copy and paste that link in another uh, page of the browser you will be good to go as you can see here the seller is enabled to receive payments since their paypal or stripe account has not been connected so you are going simply to the pay hip section go back to the dashboard and see here the setup checkout you can go ahead and set up the checkout you can add or make a link uh, of paypal account or you can set up stripe account and here we have the currency as i said before and you are going to save the settings and everything will be go well when they when or when the visitors or the buyers see the product or download the pdf that they have bought they will see this page when they click on here they can go ahead right to the template of canva and they can begin modifying and put in some elements uh, as much as they uh, they wish i have set up these templates to be fully customizable as you can see here i have added a image frame you can go ahead and add some image frames like that from elements and you know simply type frame and you will see here some photo frames you can see right here the type of frames you can add a uh, this frame like that you can adjust it and redimension it put it for this one and here i have ad added some text only to show the customers where they can put these designs these are not some professional designs these are only some explicative uh, design so we are going to understand how uh, things work and here we have the second design as you can see this is only a picture and a uh, portrait we have also here a logo page or a logo place. I'm going to put a design to let you see how is going on right here. Add this to this one. And here we go. If you want to put something, you can add a rotation for that logo. It is fully customizable as you can see. And here we have it. This I'm going to add or uh, delete this image. And for this one, it is you are going to put a font, a, a specific font like this you can also modify this font and make this only a post that was all for today's video thank you guys for watching i hope that you have enjoyed the content and hope to see you soon on the next one